All right, so let's show you my natural hair truth here. I deal with this every week. Just dry scalp, especially at my hairline. Like, it, it can get relentless. It doesn't, it happened anywhere else on my head or on my scalp except for my hairline. That's it. So, in this video, I'm going to show you how I remedy this. I do this as often as I possibly can, but just gonna show you how I get rid of this crap on my forehead. I use extra virgin olive oil because I noticed that my hair loves this stuff. So this is what I'm gonna use to do my hot oil treatment. Uh, I've done videos before of apple cider vinegar. I use about that much vinegar and put the rest in water because I really wanna make sure that my scalp is pretty much cleanse and I use a spray bottle because it's a lot easier for me to focus the extra virgin not the extra virgin but the apple cider vinegar uh, water into my scalp and not necessarily my hair so this is actually how I put it into my hair I just spray it close to my scalp and pretty much try to saturate saturate <laughs> each section of my hair and I massage it in just to make sure. And yeah, this is just pretty much how I do it. So for some extra stimulation to my scalp, I use this Lux Therapy uh, Scalp Soother. I've had this for going on five years now. And I use this to break up any dirt and sweat and accumulated product buildup off of my scalp. Um, I do it over my entire head, but my focus is really at the front of my scalp. And then I shampoo with the Shea Moisture Strength and Grow and Restore Shampoo. And I do it about twice in the shower. And then I use the Purification Mask by Shea Moisture for my scalp only, mainly in the front of my head. And once I am done washing my hair, and yes, I wash my hair with the plaits in it. Uh, I take each section a loose and just pretty much douse my uh, scalp first and then my hair with uh, extra virgin olive oil and I repeat that all over my head. So now that that's done, I cover my head twice well, three times actually. <laughs> and this is how I deep condition if I have to leave. But if I'm at home and just doing some errands, I'll use my Con Air Pro like um, portable head dryer, just attach it to a small dryer, put it over my head, and I'll just sit there and do whatever work I gotta do with this on my head for about 30 minutes. Then I rinse it all out and I try not to rinse you know, completely out, just the excess oil is what I'm rinsing out of my head. And then I take each section that uh, I twist it and I re-detangle it and retwist it again. And I'm actually twisting my hair for a purpose. There's a wig I'm gonna be wearing. So the way that I'm twisting it or the way it's gonna look is going to be uh, a little different. This is how I keep my hairline thick, extra, dark Jamaican black castor oil. I focus it mainly on the front of my hair, well, my hairline. And this is how uh, I try to take care of my hairline. This is why it's still so thick and long. It's because I use Jamaican black castor oil and I try to follow this method you have seen me do pretty much every week. And as you can see, I clip whatever ends that look scraggly and this is what my hair looks like after it has been deep conditioned, hot oil treatment up, Jamaican black castor oil added, just juicy, moisturized goodness. So I hope this video helped any of you out that has the same issue that I have. I'm still growing my hair out. This is an interesting journey, but thumbs it up if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.